I've got the power steering on. It's loose, of course, so I can tighten the belt. And the alternator on loose. It's time to slip the timing cover back on from underneath. Now to slip the top timing cover on. Now it's time to put the crank pulley on. The belts are just hanging loosely. Not going to worry about putting the key in yet. I like to slip that in last. So I just hook it over the belts and slide it on that round crankshaft. So now this uh, crank pulley is on loose and I can rotate it and I'll just rotate it around until the crank key lines up with the pulley keyway like right there and then I just slip the other key in. Now I use air tools to remove and replace these crank pulley nuts because they have to be on there really tight. Now to tighten the belts. Plastic splash covers back on. Now to put the wheel on. Now to install the motor mount. And don't forget to install the cam sensor plug. Now, tap back down the rocker cover which you previously pried up. And tighten the bolts. Now, reinstall the pretty vanity cover so the customer thinks you did a good job even though all I was doing was thinking about my next beer. Now to reinstall the green Martian piss in that hole. Well, when you're not using it for chugging beer, it makes a good funnel. Now to see if it actually runs after all this. See if I can get my beer money after all. Sweet. Runs like a Toyota. Never know what you're going to find in my shop. Well, let's go do some garbage picking. We're motoring. Ah, no tack, that sucks. It's March 31st, we still got lots of fucking snow. Ah, a bit of garbage. Ah, oh, no good garbage. At least I just found some pussy. Sweet. 